In this video, I'll be showing you how to set up kick alerts in OBS. Start by heading to the Botrix website. We will include a link in the description. Log in using one of the provided options and you will be taken to this page. Click the sign in with kick button. Type in your kick username, then click the accept button. Click continue and you'll be redirected to kick. Choose to add new, then select the search bar. Type in Botrix. Make sure you have the spelling correct, then select the correct user. It should have the verification icon next to it. Click Add, then head back to the Botrix website. Highlight and copy the link text here. Click the provided kick link and you will be redirected. Paste the copy text into the message box, then send the message. If done correctly, you will receive a line of text saying your account is linked. Head back to the Botrix website and click Finish. Click Settings in the Kick panel and the page should reload with the platform at the top set to Kick. Select Alerts from the side. Select the type of alert you want to set up. Make sure the Active Alert box is checked. Now, select where you want the alert text to appear in comparison to your alert image or animation. Set the duration for your alert. If you're using an animated alert, then you will usually want to set it to one or two seconds shorter than your alert. Select an animation. I like to use Fade for most alerts. Here, you can set the picture and sound for your alert. Clicking the blue image icon will allow you to search galleries for pictures or sounds to use for your alerts. If you have custom alerts or sounds, then click the Upload button and select it. If you want some cool animated alerts for your stream, then check out our shop linked in the description. Go through and adjust the settings to your liking. For some alerts, the text box will have a variable as indicated by curly brackets. You will typically want to leave this included to include information such as how many subs were gifted or how long someone has been subscribed for. Save settings when done. Repeat for all of the alerts you need, then head to the top of the page. Click the copy button next to the widget URL. Make sure not to share this link with anyone. Switch back to OBS. Select a scene, then add a new source using the plus icon. Choose Browser Source. Name the source Alerts, then click OK. Paste the widget URL into the URL box, replacing the existing text. Adjust the width and height. If you're using a custom alert, then you typically want to use the resolution of the alert. Otherwise, try starting with 1920 for the width and 1080 for the height. Click OK to add the alerts in OBS. Go back to the Botrix Alerts page. Click the Test Alert button for the selected alert. Then switch back to OBS and the alert will play. Drag the corners or sides to resize the alert and drag the middle of the alert box to reposition it. Select the alert source and copy it by pressing Ctrl C or Command C on a Mac. Go to another scene and paste it in with Ctrl V or Command V on a Mac. Repeat for all of your streaming scenes. You can also double click on the alert to edit the settings if needed. Make any needed adjustments and your kick alerts will now be set up in OBS. Like the video if you found it helpful and check out another video here.